Oh, of course, it's a big motivation. I think we have to use that that type of um, stat, like you just said there, as that motivation to to go on and do well. And we're in an extremely tough game at the weekend. It's not going to be easy at all. But the motivation and the drive has to be for that outcome, you know. And we have to do all we can to try and make sure that we get that outcome. But it is going to be very difficult. Burnley, a, a very intense team, very fit. You know, they cover much of the ground. We're going to have to be ready for the battle and, and a tough place to go. And, and hopefully we match them and, and can show our quality, which is is going to be tough. So I, I said at the start of the season to the boys, it will never be easy. It's never going to be easy. But hopefully we can get there sooner rather than later. So of course, all strikers want to score goals. That's what they they live and breathe for, you know, to, is to score goals. And they all want to go on runs. But I said before that got you know, that goal on the, on the weekend, that Baffy's working hard. You know, he's had some good chances to already score those goals before that and unfortunately you know the luck quite wasn't on his side and you know you do need that little bit of luck you know the first one to go in and and then you can go on a run you see all strikers doing it and um hopefully this would be a chance now for him to go on the run he could have scored a couple more he had one cleared off the line he had a couple of chances before that in the previous game so no Baffy will always be a threat he's a, he's a good player he's a top player and you know I enjoy working with him the team are getting more used to the way that he plays and Obviously, we're training it to, so that for the team to get more used to the way that he moves and, and wants to receive the ball. So hopefully we see more and more of that in the, in the next 12 games. Yeah, I, I was made aware of them. Um, I'm not fully aware of what context they were said in or, or if and what was actually said and how it was said. So, But they're not, obviously not the views shared by myself, the team or the club itself. I think the chairman's already, already said that. And, those type of matters, obviously, you leave them to the chairman. That's for him to deal with. My concerns with the first team and concentrating on them. But no, of course, it's not the views that you know I personally share or, or the team or the club itself. I have no problem whatsoever. He, he is the character he is, and you know he's a very experienced man. He's he's got great belief in what he does, and he's done a fantastic job. You know, it's what people say after games, like they said, their own view on the game can always be different to what someone else thinks. But that's their prerogative, you know. And you know, I probably didn't necessarily agree with the way he assessed the game at the end but it's not really something that bothers me or is something that's going to concern me because like I said every manager has their own views and quite rightly so so we just move on and thankfully we, we did our job we did it well and, and we try and move on to this week to do the same.